Mishapachar. Mishapachar, Mishapachchura Mishapachar, is a mountain situated in the Annapurna massif of Gandaki Pradesh, north central Nepal. Its highest peak has never been officially climbed due to the impossibility of gaining a permit from the government of Nepal. Location Mishapachar is at the end of a long spur ridge, coming south out of the main backbone of the Annapurna massif, which forms the eastern boundary of the Annapurna sanctuary. The peak is about 25 kilometers, 16 miles, north of the provincial headquarter of Pokhara. The sanctuary is a favorite trekking destination, and the site of the base camps for the south face of Annapurna and for numerous smaller objectives. The Marti Himal trek, for instance, climbs towards a minor peak. Notable features Due to its southern position in the range, and the particularly low terrain that lies south of the Annapurna Himalayas, which contains three of the ten highest peaks in the world. Mishapachar commands tremendous vertical relief in a short horizontal distance. This, combined with its steep, pointed profile, make it a particularly striking peak, despite a lower elevation than some of its neighbors. Its double summit resembles the tail of a fish, hence the name meaning fish's tail in Nepalese. It is also nicknamed the Matterhorn of Nepal. It is a sacred peak for the Gurungs and the people of Chamrung. Climbing History it is believed that Mashapachar has never been climbed to its summit. The only confirmed attempt was in 1957 by a British team led by Lieutenant Colonel Jimmy Roberts. Climbers Wilfred Noyce and ADM Cox climbed to within 150 meters, 492 feet, of the summit via the North Ridge, to an approximate altitude of 22,793 feet, 6,947 meters. Adhering to the word of honor given to the then King Mahendra, Noyce and his team descended without stepping onto the summit, thus publishing the only climbing record of the mountain a year later. No permits to climb the mountain have been issued ever after. The mountain is said to be sacred as a home to the god Shiva. There have been reports of a New Zealand climber, Bill Dens, making a successful yet illegal attempt to the summit in the early 1980s, 